Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm unboxing some clothes from Timu for my Barbie dolls. Starting off with this tracksuit, which is a nice tie-dye effect. I love the colours of this. It's sort of blues, pinks, purples, and a bit of green in there as well. So we have a pair of trousers, which have a bit of stretch in the fabric. We have Velcro fastening to the waistband. So definitely a wee bit of stretch in there, which is good and elasticated um, hems around the bottom. So the top is a long sleeved top with matching fabric. And the back is fully velcroed. So this would be perfect for going to the gym or lounging around the house. <laughs> So this is it on one of my dolls. It's a beautiful fit. And I've just paired it with a random pair of doll trainers that I had. And it was priced at £2.11. My second outfit today is a denim skirt and white blouse combo. It's an A-line skirt with a little split at the bottom of the front hem it's quite wrinkly just the way it was folded up in the bag and um, we have lovely stitching details which is sort of an orange thread so it gives a nice contrast and we have a little bit of velcro fastening at the back and again you can see the wrinkles here and I'm going to actually use my hair straightener to take those wrinkles out because the wee split's not sitting right. We also have this white blouse with an elbow length sleeve, a tie closure at the bottom and a collar which is sitting up at the minute. I'm hoping it will sit down once I get it on the doll. And yeah, this is it on the doll. The collar sits down beautifully. The wrinkles came out of the skirt with my hair straighteners. I've paired it with a pair of knee-high boots. And this top came in priced at £2.54. All prices today are in Great British Pounds Sterling. So I wrapped the, the top around her and tied it at the back. My next outfit today is this set of jeans and a top. So the jeans are, are black and they have a distressed look to them. They're actually printed on a, like a, a normal cotton fabric. There's, it's not a denim material. So all of these, what well, looks like rips and seams and everything, pockets are all printed on. So they have a distressed look around them with little rips down here at the knees. We have nice detail for the zip and the pockets and belt loops and everything. Buttons all printed on. Around the back we have more pockets and a bit of velcro. Really good, really good detail given that it's just a printed piece of fabric. And they're three quarter length. The top to go with this is green mini floral print. And again, it is the same design as the previous top with the tie closure at the bottom and the elbow length sleeves. And it came in priced at the same price, £2.54. So let me just try this on my doll. So I have tied this top in a different way, just tied the closure at the front rather than wrapping it around and tying it at the back. So you have either option. I like the length of these trousers and I like the general look of this outfit. I've paired it with a pair of black boots. And yeah, it's a really trendy, everyday outfit. Next up I have this orange hoodie set. Orange is my absolute favourite colour, so when I saw this it just had to be got. It's a lovely long sleeved hoodie sweater. Nice fabric, nice and soft and stretchy. There's no um, openings or you know, at the back to allow the doll's head through. So I'm just hoping that it does look like it has a nice wide neck. So I'm hoping that it fits over her head and easy enough to put on. It came with a pair of really short denim shorts. 
with wee um, turnips around the bottom and Velcro fastening to the back. And this set was priced at £2.96. And this is it on my doll. She really suits this colour, the colour orange, I really love it. And just paired with a simple pair of white trainers. Next up I have this jumper sweater to try. This was actually sold as a hamster sweater. Um, I don't know of anybody that puts sweaters on their hamsters, but there you go. It has a nice leopard style print on the front and plain print on the back. It's very wide um, around the waist and the neck. And it'd be around elbow length, I think, on a doll. So I thought I'd get it to see what it looks like on the Barbies anyway. Give it a wee try. And this is it on my made to move girl so it's a nice baggy jumper effect it's a nice length the wide neck means that she can wear it off the shoulder one shoulder or even the two shoulders or she can wear it up on her shoulders if you want to so yeah I quite like that and that came in priced at just £1.19 okay so my next outfit today is a gold glittery sparkle outfit I do believe it's a copy of an outfit that was used in the Barbie movie the part where she was dancing on the dance floor so it's a gold sequence jumpsuit, strapless at the top with Velcro fastening in the back. It is completely covered in sequins and absolutely beautiful. Love it. Really good for party nights. And it comes with lots of accessories. We have a couple of silver bracelets. I would have preferred to see the accessories in gold to match the outfit, but we do have gold shoes, which is nice. I do have, yeah, drop silver earrings. The gold shoes, I have seen these in silver before with other outfits, but it's nice to see them in gold. And a silver handbag, which is just plastic and doesn't open or anything. So um, again, I would have preferred to see that in gold, but maybe that's just me. So this is the outfit on her and one of my Barbies. Um, I think the trousers would have been nicer, slightly longer. They're a wee bit on the short side for me, but it's a really nice outfit. And she looks all dressed up and ready to go out and paint the town red. This outfit was two pounds and three pence. Okay, another outfit here. This one comes with the clothes and some accessories. I do like the packs that come with lots of accessories as well. So the outfit consists of this long, slim black dress. It has a ribbed texture to the fabric, which is nice, and a spaghetti strap top. The bottom is very, very narrow where the feet would be, so there's not going to be much scope for movement with the legs. I just hope it goes onto the doll okay. It came with this beanie hat that says handmade. It doesn't particularly go with the style of the outfit, in my opinion. And it came with this white fur fabric um, shawl wrap. So let me just see what's in this accessory bag. Okay, so we have a black belt, a white pair of trainers, We have why do we have one earring here? Let me just check. Did I only get one earring? Um, no, there's another one in the bag. <laughs> they do have two earrings. They're a silver drop design. Quite nice. And we also have a silver bracelet there too. So this is it on one of my dolls. It is a nice fit. It is very narrow at the bottom. And um, so I would imagine walking would be difficult in this outfit. 
So this outfit came in priced at two pounds and ninety six pence. That is all of my haul today. I do have some more items on the way, so stay tuned for that. If you like this video, do give it a thumbs up, leave me a comment or emoji below, and don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video, guys. Bye!